Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 2. Uh, so I started playing again, I started the file back up, I had to replay a little bit, and it's actually for the best that that happened, because I hit a small point of no return last time in jumping down into the sludge. Right afterwards, after I finished the video, I realized I had just picked up a key. And that there were two locked doors that we ran into a little bit earlier on. And we've been opening up all these shortcuts anyway through the various sluice gates. They're not... No, that's not what it is. I just really wanted to use the word sluice. For as many sewer levels as there are in games, I get to use the word sluice so sparingly, so infrequently. So seldom. I thought there was another one here, but... Mm, oh, that's across the bridge, so we need to put the chess piece back to lower the bridge again. Uh, we'll take care of that in a bit. What is this back here? Raccoon City Jazz Festival. Uh, we have a Z, F. Oh, there's an S circle too. S, Z, F. What is that for? I'm trying to... Th uh... It's ringing a bell. Oh, that locker! How do I get back up to that locker? Because we jumped down into the save room down here. The one that has the, um, the chest puzzle that we need to collect the pieces for. How do we get back up there? Uh, I guess I'll burn that bridge when we come to it. Where the fuck is this going? Wait, 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 wait! Oh! Resident Evil 2! <gasps> is this gonna be the other side of the door where the magnum is or where the glass case with with what I think is the magnum is it is Resident Evil 2 you're so good at level design oh my god I'm having an a religious experience with this game. It is! Oh, God. Oh, my God! They connected the sewers and the RPD! This is so cool! And this is why we still have the skate duel. I forgot this was here! God damn this video game! Oh, my God! What a fucking game! I wonder, like... If I if I were to talk to somebody who doesn't play games at all... Would I just come off as the biggest weirdo trying to explain why this is so cool? Like, what level design is and why this is so immaculate? I think I'm coming off that way. Mm, am I coming off that way to people who do play games? <laughs> no. 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 Not at all. No. <laughs> but like, really, in, in considering how you map out and create this fully realized interconnected 3D space and how you make everything loop around and connect. That is such a, 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 a an incredibly complex challenge and RE2 just nails it. Oh, I'm so happy right now. I've been having a wonderful time with this game and this is just mmm. Mm, chef's kiss. Oh, this is a part for a magnum, but I can take the badge back. 
Uh, it's not ticked off. That means I can use it again? Okay, let's take a closer look at this thing. Yeah, there is something on the back. Is that a... Yeah, that's a USB! What? It's really weird to think of, like, this fancy custom USB stick in 1997? 1998? Um, I'm, I'm still gonna stay in the RPD. I wanna grab these Magnum routes before I forget. Or in case I were to forget them, uh, when I pass back through later to get back to the sewers. Okay, so... I know exactly where this goes. Uh, and that's perfect, because we can kill two birds with one stone. I still have... Oh, there might even be another one. I have this film roll that I just picked up uh, earlier on. And then I think there's also another one in my stash. And then we can go to the safe room in the hellish liquor hallway to develop those. And then the stairs from there lead back up to the stars room with the PC from much earlier in the game. Oh, I think I may have opened that too quick. No? Nah. Okay, I didn't. Oh, fuck me! Would it be here? I don't think I'm gonna make it. Uh, uh. So it didn't get. It didn't get startled by the initial door opening noise, but something else set it off? Both of them. There are two. Shit. I'm gonna try doing that without clearing the liquors one more time and hope that that was a fluke uh and if not then i am going to have to invest some ammo god that liquor hallway is so frightening <laughs> wait oh no this is what i get left nine right 15 seven 9-15-7. Left 9-15-7. Left 9-15-7. 15. And 7. You know what? That death is a blessing in disguise because I initially for Oh, yes! 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 I didn't think there would be even more space. And now I know that there is one more hip pouch. Oh, Resident Evil 2, you spoil me. I'm gonna open this door even more carefully this time. Hmm? I'll play the fucking aggro music. And it skittered off and got distracted? Maybe the AI thinks that there's a noise somewhere, so it sent the liquor to investigate all over, but it isn't localizing the source of the noise as me. Oh, good. I hope this zombie doesn't bang on the window and get their attention. Uh, even if it does, I'm good. Oh god, the liquors are the scariest enemy in the game. Hiding place. Do I recognize this at all? That kind of looks like... It's too brightly lit to be the office we just ran through to get to the liquor hallway. Uh, the one that, with Leon's desk. Um... That could be one of the other offices in that hallway. Oh, hey, cool. DCM. Oh, fucking awesome. I think we just got two different padlock combinations this episode. Rad. Oh, 
even hearing them in the distance freaks me out because they're so fast. They can be way out of line of sight on the other end of the hall and Jesus, I thought it was coming up the stairs. That's the other one. Wow, why can I hear him so clearly from here? Armory Star's room. Fuck. I completely forget where that other locker in the RPD is. Um, I guess I'm not gonna worry about it too much. It is completely slipped my mind now. I wanna say on top of being just terrifying. This hallway is so, so beautiful. I mean, just the from the way it's lit to the mist and rain blowing almost sideways through the window and uh like the fronds of the, the leaves blowing in the wind from the storm. It's really gorgeous. Man, I kind of want that USB stick. I bet that came with the collector's edition. <laughs> yeah, now this is going to be the Magnum. This will be the Magnum. Now we can discard it. Oh, <laughs> Lightning Hawk. Lightning Hawk. Letters stars members to my best of stars buds. How are y'all doing in this drab old station? Hanging in there against old irons? Me, I just got back from a date with a hot chick. But you can bet you can guess what we got up to under her extra large umbrella. Ha 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 ha. Who is this dork? Europe's amazing. One month is in no way enough to even scratch the surface. Maybe I'll extend my vacation for another six months. Barry, you know, wait, Barry? This ain't Barry? Mm. Enjoy me when want to make all the cute girls cry, yeah? So you just leave the babes to me. Jill, if Claire tries to contact you, please let her know I'm okay. Chris Redfield. Yeah! Okay. That's kind of messed up. <laughs> Chris is just vacationing. And we actually have Claire in the game just worried sick about him in here. How did he not communicate this to her before he left and before everything went terrible? Wait, no, he would have had to have gone on vacation before the Arkley Mountain incident. For that to make any sense. What is the point of that memo then, other than to just be kind of fan servicey? Oh, here it is. Awesome. So, what is this? What? Lightning fast aiming. Is a red dot sight for the Magnum? Oh, it... Uh, it, it condenses the crosshair faster for quicker crits. Holy shit. Yeah, it's worth it. Oh man, this whole trek back to the RPD has been awesome. Ooh, and then it's time to clinch. I got worried for a second because I looked down at the body and thought it was the liquor. <laughs> breathing just fucks with me. Ooh, okay. Now, there was something that I'm missing in the library, and I do not know what it could possibly be. And I don't... Uh, I'll give it a once-over. I'm thinking it can't possibly be that important at this point. Yeah. 
Yeah, I have no idea what I might have missed here, and I'm kind of not caring. Check between the shelves real quick. Could be something upstairs, but... I'm starting to notice more than one groan. And, uh, fuck that. Thinking that by the time I find whatever it is I might be missing in the library, uh, I won't have... Oh, I never got the heart key. Oh, yeah, I was told that uh, the heart key is something that only Claire gets. And that one of them, I think it may have been the club key, is one that only Leon gets. So I think we're heading into a boss... So I'm going to take the magnum rounds out. I'm going to take grenades out. And is there anything else I want with me? Considering... Hold on. Yes, yes. We want both of those because we're going to need them. Yeah, I think that's good. Let's just add this to the lightning hawk. Uh, it takes up two spaces now, but we did just gain two. This is okay. Now I'm real curious what we're about to be fighting in the sewer. Because that room was just a gigantic open rectangle. It has to be a boss fight. Wait, hmm... I'm thinking about it now, and I'm actually not sure. Because there's still the two missing chess pieces, so I I would imagine that we're going to get those first and then fight a boss, but hmm, maybe they're the reward that we're going to get for doing that boss. Uh, we still have to do this real quick. So there's that other door. Yeah, it was at the opposite end of the bridge. Good. Man, I love this game so much. May have messed up. Hmm. Mayhaps should have dumped uh, a little bit more. Like, I really didn't need to get both of those pieces out, for instance. Since I'm not going to be using them yet anyway. Uh, what's my quickest route back to the save room? It's not through here. Is it? No. I have to go back to the circular hallway and then take the stairs up. Which means I have to wade through sewage one more time. I think we're basically good. Basically good to go. We've there's very little waiting behind us to backtrack to. Uh, eventually, I would kind of like to find my way back to the locker in the sewers. But even then, I'm if I never end up getting back there, I don't feel like I'm going to be devastated by that. Feeling okay. Wait, we can actually look down into the room from here, and I didn't see anything but a giant red door at the end of that hall. Hmm. 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 I've got to use my head and think. I might be wrong about that being a boss arena. Uh, either way, we're going to go in loaded for bear and treat it like it is. Because I have more than enough inventory space for a lot of bullets. 
Oh, and we don't even need the key anymore. Great. Do not discard the good gunpowder. Uh, in fact, two of those makes magnum ammo. And I know I have more than one of those. Just been hoarding the uh, gunpowder. And apparently for good reason. Good shit. That and... There was no mention of a grenade launcher, but that's a pretty typical RE staple. Should also do this. Lest I have to start over again. There's a high-pitched drone that starts playing when you exit the save room into that area. And it puts me a little bit on edge. Not gonna lie. Because why? <laughs> ours is not to wonder why, ours is but to do and die. There's an even higher pitched whine. Oh shit! I forgot that since I reloaded the what save the after the death, that? I hadn't been back down here to re trigger that. <laughs> oh, friend. Great. I forgot that this was here. So this isn't a boss arena, I just have to go through these. Ah, fucking lovely. Well, this is gonna be our first time fighting this, so... I hope this works. Oh, great! I'm not dumping the good shit into this until I think that it is maybe necessary. You just spit, boys? Holy shit. Oh! Oh! All things considered, that went okay. And now I have dudes following me. Oh, fuck. There's like a, a nasty blister covering the eye here. And he started spitting, boys, right away. Um. <gasps> oh. Okay. Wow. That. Like the Titan. Made this an expensive investment of ammo. Yeah, they are really just resource dumps. Not all that threatening, but they are grotesque. Please don't be a third one. Because if there's a third one, I have to use my Magnum. The first two, I got away with only firing one Magnum bullet. And one grenade, but... It's not like I... had the most use in the world for grenades up till now. I should have carried a blue herb with me. Fuck! Oh, God. That's a problem for another day. Oh, boy, that's not gonna be fun. Okay. Oh, is that a blue friend? No, that's a red friend. Okay. 
Okay. We have this. Oh, hey. There's one of the chest pieces, so I'm going to take this and it's going to close the gate. Yes. Uh, let's put that back for now. Just figure out what the deal with this place is. Can't go through here. Unless we brought... Oh no, I think that takes a specific chess piece. Oh, there's my blue friend. Okay, so we're gonna grab you. And then put you here. Oh, this is just gonna be a cool little maze. Oh, awesome. And then you. Okay, so we need another piece, and that should be in here. Hello. Um. I think a zombie just dropped from the ceiling. Okay, we're gonna shut that, and we never need to come back up here. Where? Oh! Okay. So now that that gate is open and we have a second piece, we can put this here. What? What? Chemical flamethrower. The longer you torch a target, the bigger the flames. I... Oh shit, I wasn't expecting that to return. Or I guess for it to return in RE7? Assuming that it was in vanilla Resident Evil 2? Okay, so now I have to work my way out of here. Just figuring out which piece is gonna go where. Because I have to not only get out of here, but I have to get out of here in such a way that I can claim both of these, and that's what that shortcut's for. Okay, cool. Oh, there we go. Hey, we did it. Pretty sure. So we can get to that from here, right? Yeah. Cool. Oh, that's really nifty. Uh, I did lose track of where I put one of the pieces for like two minutes. I couldn't find it in the dark. <laughs> so I got stuck for a second. Like I must have did that. Uh, I must have did that circuit like five times, unable to figure out where I put one of the pieces. <laughs> oh, okay, friends. There you are, you motherfucker. Let's see how much flamethrower ammo. Pissing through on this dude. Got a little bit nervous that something was gonna come out of the pipe. I hope I'm close enough. Oh!
Okay, the high pitch is the death rattle. So about 150 flamethrower fuel. This is very flammable sewage. Oh, the smell must be horrendous. Of feces and urine and monster goo. But also all of it on fire, too. Oh god, I can't jump down with it there. Um... Oh, I hate this. I hate this. I think I have to go back in to get it to come out. Oh, oh god! Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, it's some very flammable sewage. Where do you- ah! Please die. Ooh. Well, now I got this cool flamethrower. They also good job because they didn't give away that I was going to be getting this by giving me things like a flamethrower fuel leading up to this point. So, good job, video game. You did oh, shit! Oh, no, and that's a grenade, too. I chose to eat the damage instead of losing a grenade. I think I may have gone the wrong way, too. Oh, so I'm going to have to go deal with this motherfucker again anyway. I feel like I'm much more well furnished on health supplies than I am uh, ammo or grenades or anything like that at this point. So, I would rather take the hit than use a grenade on him. Anyway, that is going to do it for now. What an episode. Uh, thank you all for watching. Take it easy. Have a good one. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Go to my Patreon, Twitter, Twitch, all that stuff. Thank you.